Hello everybody out here on YouTube. It is I Here with Beautiful Beauty. Going to be talking about dry shampoo. Okay guys, so I almost have to just really laugh about this because it, dry shampoo has become a, like nature to me. It's become secondary, you know what I mean? I've uh, been using dry shampoo for a very long time, or at least it seems. Um, feels like a long time, so you know, it feels like definitely it's been a few years. So, one of the best dry shampoos, honestly, that I've come across in my many years of looking, researching, my findings, all that good stuff, Batiste. Batista, Batiste is still the best brand that I have yet to come across. And I have used high ends, um, low end brands, expensive brands, cheaper brands, drugstore brands, department store brands. I have used the gamut. And this is still just the best. It really is. Now, every now and then I get, um, I end up buying a can of it and I get like, I, I guess I get maybe a can that's not as fresh or maybe a stale can and um, it, it wants to spray out and sputter out like straight powder. It just wants to shoot out of the can like powder. But I think that that is just an issue of, you know, how long has the product been sitting on the shelf? When was it manufactured? All that other stuff. But still, just the same. This is the best brand so far. And I still like this one in the blue can, the original. That's my favorite formula. Um, you know, during the holidays, you get these little cute gift sets and stuff. So I got this little shampoo trio, dry shampoo trio, a uh, little gift set type of deal that came with um, these three right here. The original still works the best in all honesty. To me, it smells the best, it is the best, it works the best, it performs the best. It does uh, a better job, it just really does a lot better job. Uh, my second favorite here is the tropical flavor. This is my second, my second favorite. Uh, has a really good smell to it. For this, the smell is um, very pleasant. It doesn't really. I have crazy bad sinus problems. I have a scent sensitivity issue. The smell is not super overpowering um, or anything like that. And it it just it, it smells really good. So it doesn't give me sinus problems. I know that the Dove dry shampoo. A lot of people really love the Dove dry shampoo. Uh, you guys, I simply cannot do the Dove dry shampoo because the smell is just, uh, the, the smell, the texture of it, it does not work very well for my hair at all. It actually, the Dove dry shampoo actually makes my hair oilier than uh, it naturally gets or oilier than it is rather, you know what I mean? So anyhow, this is my second favorite. Really do like the tropical uh, smell, flavor, scent, and I like this formula. This is my second best formula here. And third place winner here, here is, and the third best would be this one, the blush, the floral and fruity blush. I just, I don't like the smell of it. I don't like the performance of it. I feel like it just does not work as good as the original or as good as the Tropical. It just doesn't. To me, it doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. Um, you know, I know if you are new to dry shampoo, it does take a little bit of getting used to, especially with your hair, making that transition period, your scalp, your hair follicles, your sebaceous glands, all that good stuff. You make a little bit of a transition when you start to use dry shampoo. And also, um, if you are a frequent dry shampoo user like I am, you get a lot of, you end up with a lot of that buildup over time. And dry shampoos just really build up at the roots. So definitely throw in a um, hair clarifying shampoo at least once a month just to get that residue and that residual buildup out of the roots, off your roots, you know, off your scalp, off the top of your hair and all that stuff. So, and some people never do that, but you need to really use a good clarifying shampoo at least once a month if you are on a regular basis a dry shampoo user. Um, let's see what else I could tell you guys about it. Now, I know that um, some people also think this is a little bit of a misconception when you use dry shampoo. What I like to do is I shampoo my hair one day and then second day hair, that's when I start really using the dry shampoo. Um, and a lot of people will take a shower, have completely clean hair, use their dry shampoo on clean hair. And for a lot of people that works best to use your dry shampoo on clean hair. 
it's kind of like you're using the dry shampoo before your hair has the chance to get dirty, before it has a chance to get, you know, grimy or greasy or um, any of the um, oil buildup on it, you know. So a lot of people do that. They will put it straight away onto their clean, dry, freshly shampooed hair. And that's when they say it works best. But honestly, on the very first day for me, it doesn't work that great. I do it on second day hair. So if I do it like, um, if I shampoo my hair, and if I shampoo my hair like in the evening, right, say 6, 7 p.m., 8 p.m., and I wake up the next morning and then I use dry shampoo, that second day hair is the best way for my hair to respond to dry shampoo. It just, it really, um, it gives my hair a lot of volume, a lot of oomph, of course, a lot of root lift. And not only that, it gives my hair, the ch it does not give my hair the chance to build up the greasiness or the oiliness and all that, you know, all that stuff. So anyhow, yeah, I, I love, Batisti, Batista, Batisti, and I've been using it forever and a day, but I, I don't know. I, I, I hear so many people pronouncing it so many different ways, but anyhow, it really doesn't make a difference, you know, how you say the name of it. It just makes a difference. Does the product work for you? Do you like the product? Do you rebuy the product? Do you continue to repurchase the product? And, you know, of course, yes. I'm really feeling the tropical stuff this time though, you know. This is always my favorite, but I am enjoying the tropical. And I know I've used this before, so this is not really a new product to me rather, but it's like a rediscovered, you know. I'm like, oh yeah, I remember using that. So it's like a rediscovered product. Yeah, and um, I love the holidays because especially around the month of December, you get these little deals in the drugstore and you know, and, and it just seems so cute, you know. But I thought that was nice that you have a chance to at least try all three of them in this little gift setty type of deal. Yeah, okay. Okay, guys. Be sure to give me a big, huge thumbs up. Be sure to give me a big, huge like. As always, like, share, and subscribe. Bye, beauties.